While it's very demanding on the body and is quite expensive, construction layout is one of the most profitable types of surveys. After the design phases between the civil engineer and the architect are complete, the surveyor is required to go back out into the field in order to establish the positions of whether it's the buildings or the utilities, along with their respective offsets on site. And so if the weather is freezing like it is now in Michigan, or it's extremely hot and the sun is baking the surveyors in the field, somebody needs to set the stakes in the ground exactly where the civil engineer designed it. And that right there is what most of us surveyors did in our summer internships. We typically use total stations for this type of project because it really does require a high level of accuracy, sometimes within sub-centimeter levels of accuracy, which is why we depend on a total station to do that. Once a construction project is complete and the buildings are built, the utilities are in the ground, and the sidewalks and driveways are put in, a surveyor is required to verify that everything was built to the designs. And while there's several steps in between construction layout and as-built, the as-built really ties up everything in the end. We check the XYZ coordinates of various features on site. We check that drainage is working, making sure there's no puddling or any kind of major defects on site. We ensure that the utilities are all running and that the building is built using the correct material and to the same specifications as the design plan. You can think of as-built surveys like topographic surveys, but a little less demanding. Think of it as a softer or lighter version with less intensity for accuracy and really you're just validating that everything is working and built correctly and not going to cause any problems in the future. Now you could really use any piece of equipment. You could use a total station. You could use a GNSS receiver. You can even use like an automatic level and a tape measure. I've done as-built drawings like this using very basic tools and just measuring to make sure that the buildings are the right size and that the elevations match the drawing. But if you want to get really fancy, you could definitely use a drone to do your as-built survey. Using photogrammetry and taking imagery and creating an ortho image of the entire site is a great way to present the final product to your client. It's good for marketing and good for repeat business. So definitely leverage new technology and help it expand on your surveying work.